Today we are going to read the book Commotion in the Ocean. This book is written by Giles Andrie and is illustrated by David Wojtowicz. There is a curious commotion at the bottom of the ocean. I think we ought to go and take a look. You will find every sort of creatures that live beneath the sea swimming through the pages of this book. There are dolphins, whales and penguins. There are jellyfish and sharks. There's the turtle and the big white polar bear. But can you see behind the wrecks and in between the rocks? Let's see if we can find who's hiding there. Crabs. The crabs like walking sideways and I think the reason why is to make himself look sneaky and pretend that he's a spy. Turtles. We crawl up the beach from the water to bury our eggs in the dry land. We lay a whole bunch and when they hatch they scumber about in the sand. Pitter patter, pitter patter. See the mummy turtle and the babies? Wow, they're moving towards the sea. Dolphins. The wonderful thing about dolphins is hearing them trying to speak. But it's not, how do you do, like I'd say to you. It's more of a click, whistle, squeak. Squeak, squeak. Do you want to listen to the dolphin squeak? We're going to meet Zala right now, right? Say hi. Yeah. Angelfish. Hello. I'm the angelfish, darling. The prettiest thing in the sea. What a shame there are no other creatures as gorgeous and lovely as me. Jellyfish. The jellyfish just loves to jiggle. Which other fish thing is quite dumb. She knows it's not all that useful. But jiggling, jiggling is very good fun. Sharks, I swim with a grin up to meet you. See how my jaws open wide? Why don't you come a bit closer? Please take a good look inside. <gasps> look at his teeth, it's so sharp. No, do you know sharks are very dangerous? Look at the little fish. Oh no, they're running away. Yikes! Swordfish. I love to chase after small fishes. It stops me from getting too bored. And then when I start feeling hungry, I skewer a few on my sword. Octopus. Having eight arms can be useful. You may think it's a bit funny, but it helps me to hold all my children and tickle each one of them on the tummy. Look. This octopus has got four children and they're so happy. Mummy is tickling them. Oh, look how helpful she is. She's holding up the mirror for the starfish. Can you see that near the treasure box? Stingray. At the bottom of the ocean, the stingray flaps his wings and don't you get too close to him. His tail really stings. Lobsters. Never shake hands with a lobster. It isn't a wise thing to do. With a clippity clap and a snippity snap, he would snip all your fingers in two. Oh goodness, that's dangerous. Snippity snap, clippity clap. Deep sea. Miles below the surface, where the water's dark and deep, live the most amazing creatures that you could ever meet. There are fish of all descriptions, of every shape and size. Some have giant pointy teeth and great big bulbous eyes. Some of them can walk around, 
and balance on their fins. But the strangest fish of all have glowing whiskers on their chins. Glowing whiskers on their chins? Hmm. Blue whale. There's no other beast on the planet as big as the giant blue whale. He measures a massive 100 feet long from his head to the tip of his tail. Barnacles. We're just a bunch of barnacles and all we do is cling. We know it's not that glamorous but it's our favorite thing. Walruses. Our bodies are covered with blubber and our tusks are incredibly long. We are grumpy and proud and we bellow out loud to show that we are mighty and strong. Penguins. We waddle about on our iceberg which makes our feet slither and slide and when we get close to the water we, we leap with a splash off the side. Splash! Look at the baby penguin sliding down and falling into the water. Polar bears. Deep out in the Arctic, the mummy polar bear snuggles up with her children as it's very cold out there. What a lot of creatures we have seen beneath the sea. What a lot of funny things they do. Some of them might lick their lips and eat you in one bite. And some might want to swim around with you. The dolphin's very friendly and the lobster's very fierce. But the shark is the most dangerous by far. Can you name the other friends we've made along the way? See if you can tell me who they are. Thanks for watching and please do like, share and subscribe my channel.